This programme contains strong language and sexual references from the outset and throughout. Today's a big day for me. I'm finally going to meet all the girls from my bladder support group. Hi! 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 We've been talking for so long over WhatsApp, but I've never actually met them in person. I'm so pleased that you have came because I feel like it's really good that we got together. Like, yeah. you all know, like, deepest, darkest secrets of mine, and it's like we've never even met. It's funny, isn't it? Because of the condition that we're so, like, intimate with the details of the condition that we wouldn't be with, like, friends and family. Yeah, but it's yeah. just because we know, we understand, so it's like you can share it and not be judged. How does it affect your sex life? That's kind of probably my biggest trigger, more so than any food or drink or anything really? like that. Yeah. For me now, when I find a partner, like, obviously, Everyone thinks, that, oh, the bigger the willy, the better. But with this condition, now yeah, I'm like, you know what? I'm actually a little bit scared of big willies now. So <laughs> if I meet someone and it's not so big, I'm not moaning, because I'm like, at least it won't hurt. It's so weird, because I've only just met these girls today, but I feel like we've known each other for years. I would just feel like old friends. Any of you scared of bacteria now as well? Like, I'm a germ freak now. I never was, ever. But I'm scared of, like, any bacteria, like, even sitting on this grass now, I'm like... You make me laugh when you send messages about dirty toilets. So I'm not oh, sitting on that toilet. No. <laughs> it's because you know sometimes when I'm sitting, if, I, if I'm like crunching down on the toilet, like this, I'm worried that the back is going to jump when you flush it. <laughs> oh, honestly, I'm so scared of backsplash as well when like Casey's having a poo. What would you do, Marnie, if the doctor said they've actually found the cause of this problem for you and it is actually Casey's poo backsplash? Oh, my. <laughs> you know what it is? I, I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> honestly, the amount of shit he has, I'd actually kill him. I'd, honestly, I'd, I'd have a break up with him. I mean, I'm laughing at it, but I actually mean it. I'd be fuming. But you, honestly, I'm so, I've had such a good time. Like, just chatting to people who understand it makes the world of difference. Like, I'm so pleased I met you all. It's been so amazing getting to know these girls. And for the first time in months, I've been able to just forget about the pain and just have a laugh. Pain's brought us together. Yeah, it really it's has. Like, it's the one good thing to come from it. The bladder sisterhood. Yeah. <laughs> sisterhood. <laughs> <Woo>. <laughs> Today I'm meeting up with one of my best friends, Zahida, and we are going wedding day underwear shopping. Now I know that it's months away, but it's a good excuse to get out of the house and have some girl time. It's quite a big thing, isn't it? Like shopping for wedding lingerie. It's going to be... It's going to be your first night married. It's We're going to be needed. consummating. Yeah. So it's very big word for my like... over vocabulary today. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's so important to have sexy lingerie on your wedding night because that's going to be your husband and you don't want your forever person to think you're going to be boring in the bedroom. So it's nice to keep them excited and show that you're going to be a little bit of a slut sometimes. I mean, that's going to cover my entire enlarged roof <laughs> booty. <laughs> It would barely cover the cheeks. I don't think your bum's that big. I, lo I really like the bra, though. Do you? Oh, yes. He has my anus. <laughs> <laughs> See through as well. Do you know what I'm really looking for as well? Like, some earrings. I actually, like, adore those. Yeah, they're so. beautiful. I'm really excited about oh, planning a hen for you with mm -hmm. Tom. I think it's going to be amazing. We've got a couple of ideas already. I am having my main hen do in Ibiza, but Zahida and my other best friend Tom have decided they want to do something for me in the UK. They are both absolutely crazy, so I know I've got to lay down some ground rules first. If I see a stripper pull up in his car or like any kind of man from the special forces, a policeman, <laughs> a paramedic, I'm just going to leave. <laughs> No males except Tom. Right, OK. <laughs> so do you actually want those earrings? Though? Yeah, I actually think I'm going to get them because I would really like to wear them on the wedding day. I'm going to just get them for you as a little wedding present. No, you I don't do have to do that. No, I'm going to. You deserve it. Oh, air hug. Don't have an air hug. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Come Let's on, then. Go. I have got the most beautiful pair of earrings that I think I'm going to wear on my wedding day, so I'm just so grateful to Zahida, and I've had a lot of fun today. Hey guys, it's Marnie here. If you want more Jodie OJ videos like this one, then don't forget to like and subscribe now. What are you waiting for?